a really powerful place to stand in is challenging your own worldview, accepting that sometimes we're all wrong, sometimes we've gotten things wrong, and then we all grow as human beings. Hi, I'm Monroe, and this is my Attitude cover shoot on sale now. My podcast is called The Way We Are, and it's about the formative challenges hurdles, obstacles that we all encounter as human beings and how we get over them, how we learn lessons from them and how we implement those lessons into our futures to become the people that we want to be, but also looking at who we were, who we are and how we will be. So something that excites me about this moment that we're in is that we're all listening to the stories and experiences of people who aren't like us. And I feel like we've never really been in this position within society where the voices of marginalized people are being heard in a way that they've never been before. So I'm really excited about providing a space where people can show a new side to themselves or you know, present new information about something that they've been through in their past. And I think it makes our world feel a lot smaller and it makes our demons feel a lot easier to deal with as humans when we can hear other people talking about what they've been through. In the first few episodes, we've got Mabel, who is a friend of mine. I've been in one of her music videos and we met a couple of years ago, but I've always been so impressed with her work ethic and how much she performs and how much she puts into her performances. I've never seen a pop girl perform as much as she has over the last few years. My personal Drag Race fave, Bimini Bomboulash, just seeing them blossom in Drag Race and talking about their story of understanding their own identity and bringing that to such a wide audience on such an influential platform as Drag Race is so inspiring. And uh, I, I'm so excited that I get to share this moment with them and also see them blossom. You know, non-binary representation within the UK is so important, especially with what that community are facing with this government not listening to them. So this podcast is all about listening. It's all about understanding that we're all human and we all go through stuff. At the end of the day, every single experience that we experience as humans is a human experience. So I'm honored to share this with Bimini. I think when we're vulnerable, it's a rewarding place to be because our walls come down and we stop, you know, rejecting the difficult stuff to process. We start being a little bit more open to new information. I think that a really powerful place to stand in is challenging your own worldview, accepting that sometimes we're all wrong Sometimes we've gotten things wrong and then we all grow as human beings. So, and we don't get to those places unless we share, unless we drop our defenses, drop our walls and just see each other as human beings. So I'm very excited about not only listening to other people's experiences, but sharing some of my own. I want this podcast to be a conversation. It's not me interviewing people, it's me having a chat and a really deep dive into each other's psyches and come into a place where we learn stuff from each other. Thanks for watching my behind the scenes video with Attitude Magazine and make sure you check out my new podcast, The Way We Are, exclusively on Spotify.